the image of Maria Bambina. It was molded by a Franciscan nun from Toti, Sister Isabella Chiara Fornari, and was brought to Milan in 1738 by Monsignor Alberico Simonetta. It stayed for a while with various religious institutes till it was finally given into the keeping of Father Luigi Bosisio, Paris priest of St. Mark. In 1842, the latter handed it to the community of the Sisters of Charity, who rendered service at Chichari Hospital. In 1876, Maria Bambina followed the sisters from Chichari Hospital to the new generalate in Via Santa Sofia. There, in 1884, the young postulant Giulia Macario, who was seriously ill, was miraculously cured on kissing it. It was then decided to expose the image in a provisional chapel until in 1888 it was installed in its place of honor in a true and proper sanctuary inside the convent. These events were hailed by an increasingly devoted public and numerous pilgrims flowed to the small sanctuary. In the air raid of August 1943, the sanctuary was destroyed, but Maria Bambina had been safely taken away to Majanico di Lecco. The new sanctuary, designed by the architect Giovanni Muzio, rose on the adjoining plot and was consecrated by Cardinal Ildefonso Squister on 20-21 November 1953. Giving access to the sanctuary from a small cloister is a portal with figures and symbols representing the prefiguration of Mary in the Old Testament. Inside, the pervading whiteness of stucco work and marble suggests the idea of cradle shrine with its insights into Mary's grace in the mystery of her birth. In the apse is the imposing niche with the little temple that holds the image of Maria Bambina. On the background, bunches of flowers, rays and angels hastening from on high to announce the rejoicing in heaven and on earth over the dawn of salvation. Mary, lift your tender tiny hand and impart your blessings on us all. An exceptional grace was the visit of John Paul II on 4th November 1984 after his pilgrimage in honour of St. Charles. A memorial tablet at the side entrance and a lamp kept lit for the Pope speak of it. The Pope left us the task of contemplating the mystery of Mary's childhood as an aspect of our spirituality, since 
first May 2013, a tiny niche at the altar of the Assumption holds a precious relic, a little blood of St. John Paul II, preserved after a blood test at Gemelli. The stained glass windows depict the Blessed Virgin's life along the theme, Mary, Temple of Jesus. The abs fillet in mosaic above the niche represents the universal meditation and regality of the Mother of God. The altar pieces of the side chapels portray Mary's participation in the sacrifice of her son and her assumption into heaven. Fitted into the layout of the sanctuary are some works of art, originally in the wall chapel, saved from wall damage and therefore bearing memories of the past. The kingdom of heaven is of children and especially of a little child, Mary. <music> 